I was born in space, and the only humans I ever knew were my own parents. <laughs> Strange as that may sound, perhaps to you, people of the future, looking at this diary and their tireless search for a planet that was like Earth meant nothing to me. I, I only knew our ship, and I only knew the dreams of space. My bones are different. My bones are of a different density. I've been given all the treatments. So I am more of a space creature than a creature of land. And I'm all right with that. But I have always wanted to know the surface of a planet, the surface of an Earth-like planet. Yes, that's my origin. That's what my parents always wanted me to experience. So, after their deaths, I put myself in the cryostasis chamber, and I told my ship's computer, just wake me up when you find a planet. I don't care if it's 30 years from now, 60 years from now, I'll stay in cryostasis. We've got enough energy. And cryostasis for me is a liquid experience. I am liquid, my dreams are liquid, and I feel I've spent more time as a liquid than I have in this human body. Strange as it may sound. But I am alone here. And I, I don't know what it is like to be human, to be in community, to, to be useful to anyone but myself here in this cryostasis chamber until the cryo criminals arrived. And they injected my cryostasis chamber with something beautiful indeed. The dream of a real human life. The dream, the dream, the dream, the dream. Hey Sawdust Squad, how you doing? My name is Tiffany Toolbox and I am here to offer you tips on your toolbox and the tools within it. I am a home improvement expert and I take your questions and answer them. Oh, hold on a second. I better get on my um, my protective gear, um, which like is really important for this sort of thing. Wow, now that I'm all suited up, Mo, um, can you roll the first clip? What's well, a hammer? Well, Nicholas, that's a great question. I can tell that you might be new at this, but don't worry. We all gotta start somewhere. You'll be a hammerhead in no time. Uh, so, hammers are this. Uh, they're a variety of kinds, and you can uh, put the, like that. You gotta start somewhere, you know? I thank you so much for your question, Nicholas. I just wanna say, like, um, even I don't know everything, uh, and I'm learning every day. So, these are hammers. Mo, let's saw into that next question. What should I do if I lose my hex key? Danny, thank you so much for your question. I'm gonna level with you. Get it? Just like fun fact, in America, we actually call the hex key an Allen key. Who is Allen? Allen is the special fairy that lives inside of every Allen key. And all you gotta do is just go Allen, Allen, and then your hex key will appear. Sounds like something's lost in translation for you, Danny. But thank you for your question. Another toolbox fell over. Hey Mo, roll the next clip. Let's dig into it. How do I turn on my drill? Wow, Jen, thanks for your question. I know you're a longtime subscriber, so I want to thank you for yet another great and insightful question. One of the things about any power tool oh, um, is just basically like um, that you you gotta whisper to it to turn it on, right? So you just gotta create a relationship with that tool and you gotta wait till it, um, till it likes you. You know, you just keep building that relationship. There's no uh, button, only, only the whispering. So I hope that helps. Thank you everyone for your questions. My name is Tiffany Toolbox and this has been uh, Tips Tips. The dream of a real human life. I have to get back to that life where I was so useful to people with such knowledge and I don't care if it's real or, or, or a dream. I must find these dealers, these cryo criminals, criminals who inject the tanks. With I will find my way back then. Look out for my next diary. What's well, a hammer? I my, I my hex key?